Welcome to this quick video to demonstrate Knowledge, an AI-powered e-learning production platform. What's really impressed us about the platform so far is the speed with which interactive resources can be created. This is done automatically using a variety of different multimedia source formats, including video, audio, document, web and text. In this example, I've taken a five minute video focusing on evidence-based decision making. Within the platform, I'm creating a new project, selecting my language, and using manual mode so that I can edit as I go. In this first stage, the AI has scraped my content and created a transcript. This is to then base any newly generated content on. The second stage is to review and tweak the content. This includes the concepts the AI has identified and any interactivity around these. I can edit right down to the question wording and format or activity type. There is also a summary generated along with key points on the final slide. The whole process took about five minutes and has created an extensive package. My video is now interactive with information and concept pop-ups along the timeline. Here's an accordion type glossary explaining the terms. And there are flashcards designed to help students memorize key points. Other activities include fill the word, multiple choice, true and false quizzes, and drag and drop. At the end, I'm presented with a summary and progress page. In terms of customization, I can tweak the interactive elements and change their type and frequency. Each package can be downloaded in a SCORM or H5P compatible format, and this can be uploaded elsewhere. I'm able to share via Google Classrooms or simply using a web link and embed code. The H5P version is compatible with the Canvas VLE, and this is part of the university's ongoing H5P pilot project. From here, we can make further refinements to the resource. One potential use for this technology could be to turn existing lecture capture content into further blended learning, revision or formative assessment resources.